Hey guys, welcome to Digit and in this video we are going to be teaching you how to install the WD Blue SN550 M.2 NVMe SSD into a motherboard. Now this is an M.2 card and that too it uses the NVMe protocol in order to transfer data. Now M.2 cards go into an M.2 connector slot. On this motherboard, you can identify M.2 connectors by looking at a bridge like this and then you'll have certain screw mounting holes that are placed at distances of 60 millimeters, 80 millimeters and 110 millimeters from the connector. Now, this is one such slot. These slots usually have a little heatsink over the top, so they might be present in this fashion and you can easily identify an M.2 connector by the heatsink that is placed on top. Now, in order to install the SSD, we need to first take the SSD and look at the notch that is present. The notch must align with the notch present in the motherboard. In this case, you can see at this edge, there's a notch that aligns with the SSD. Simply take the SSD, line it up with the notch, and press it slightly. Once installed, the SSD will be slightly elevated at an angle and you can press it down. If this elevation is present, that means your SSD has gone all the way into your slot and is properly set. Now, in order to secure it in place, you need to use a screw and mount it at this edge. Now, since this particular SSD uh, or rather this particular slot comes with a heat sink we are going to be using the heat sink in order to secure it in place now before using the heat sink you should always see the underside there's a thermal pad and there might be a protective covering that you should remove in this case we've already removed the protective pad covering once you have the ssd properly mounted in place and you have the heat sink in your hand simply insert the screws and align the screws with the screw holes that are present on the socket. You have one on this end and one on this end. And your heatsink goes on top. Simply take the heatsink, place it on top, align it, and by holding it down with a finger, simply take a screwdriver and start screwing the screws into the slot. There is no force required and once installed, the SSD will not be visible at all, such as the case in front of you. And that was it for this particular video. We've installed the WD SN550, that is the WD Blue NVMe SSD into a motherboard in the M.2 slot and now all that's left is for you to boot up the operating system and partition the hard drive so that you can use it properly. Thank you for watching.